What's up, guys? This is Daniel Fack from Bar Shield, episode 93 of Bar Tip Tuesday. This week, we're going to kind of uh, touch on uh, different bumper plates and just kind of inspecting these on what you should be looking for um, to make sure that they're safe for use. So basically, um, I was working out today, just doing some deadlifts, so no dropping from the shoulder or overhead. Um, and I have a 15 pound uh, Rogue HD plate here. Um, these plates, uh, you know, are kind of a glossier finish. Uh, they're made in China. They're one of the more, more economical plates that you'll see. Uh, typically in a functional fitness or CrossFit box um, in your city or town. And so what you see here um, might be a little hard to see, but we'll have a, a picture linked up here as well. But you're starting to see some cracking that is occurring around the insert here. So we have a stainless steel insert. So this gym is about you know, three or four years old. So we have an insert here that's starting to have quite a bit of play. So it's moving around. A decent amount so that's due to all of the drops from overhead and a lot of time you'll see it more with a 10 pound plate or a high temp one so the recycled rubber plates so you'll start to see them actually bend like this it's much more exaggerated if you're doing cleaning jerks or snatches and you're dropping the bar from overhead you'll start to see these fold kind of like a taco so that's why we always preach and say to drop them from the hips if at all possible Obviously, that's not always the case when you know you're 100 reps into a workout. Um, so basically, we just are recommending that you inspect your plates. Um, if you see one that is cracked, um, you know, just be uh, aware of that because if you if they become too cracked, then it might be unsafe to use, and then these inserts will actually come out. So uh, just for example, the uh, HD plates from Rogue, the warranty on those for the 10s and 15s is only 90 days. And I think it's three years for 25 to 45 pound plates for the HG. Um, so whatever plates you have, whether it's high temp, HG, you know, Fringe makes uh, some awesome plates, Aleco, make sure you get uh, familiar with their warranties um, just to see what you're kind of up against. And then make sure you always communicate to your classes um, just proper etiquette, whether you're weightlifting or if you're doing, you know, Isabel, or you know, a bunch of reps in a workout and you're dropping constantly. So you can get the most out of your plates and you could save some money in the long run. So uh, yeah, we'll, be, we'll see you in the next week on episode 94 and we'll be talking about um, some of the droppings uh, or some of the surfaces to drop on and which to not drop on depending on what type of plates you're using. So see you next week.